Good morning. Happy July 6th. It is Tuesday. It is day six. We're coming on um, the set up upon the seventh day, one week down. Um, those of us that are going according to the guideline that was um, given that we're fasting until 10 a.m. And after on the eighth, we'll begin fasting until 11 a.m. But today is day six, and our prayer topic for today is pray for strength. And our scripture is Isaiah 41 and 10, and it reads as thus, Fear thou not, I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am thy God. I will strengthen thee, yea, I will help thee. Yea, I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. And so we're praying today for God to give us strength. You know, a lot of times... We have phrases like, I got to be strong for the children, I have to be strong for the family, I got to be strong for them, or I'm just trying to stay strong. But God's strength is made perfect in our weakness. When we don't have enough strength to do what we think we need done, we that's when we, most of the time, allow God to do what it is that he does best and allow his strength to um, come forth. And so this morning, we're praying for God to give us his strength, that we don't have to be strong on our own, we don't have to depend on our own. On, on our own dent and effort, our own uh, internal willpower, but allow God to be our strength and not just for us, right? The consecration is for us, but it's also for others, right? We are fasting and praying for our families. And so we're praying for their strength as well. Lord, we praise and we thank you for this day, God. We glorify you. We honor you. And we lift you up. There is none like you. And Lord, we just praise and we thank you for your strength on this morning. That your strength is made perfect. It is whole. You, We allow you to do what it is that you do best when we are weak. And so God, we come before you vulnerable. We come before you owning up to the fact that we don't have everything under control. That we don't have any power, God. But it's all in your hands. So God, we ask you to give us your strength on this season. Strength to fight. Strength to stand. Strength to turn against the enemy. Strength to bring our flesh under subjection of the Holy Spirit. Strength to go through this consecration. God, give us strength. Strength to stand and keep our boundaries. Strength to stand in integrity and discipline in the word of God and the edicts of you. God, give us your strength, oh God. Strength to fight the enemy. Strength to uh, fight uh, the good fight of faith. God, give us strength, oh God. Strength to pray like we should. Strength to fast like we should. God, strength to study out your word. Strength to go about and allow you to make changes in us. That we be the men and the women you called us to be. God, give us your strength on this morning, oh God, in the name of Jesus. God, fill us with your spirit from the crown of our head to the soles of our feet. God, that we be the women and the men you called us to be. God, that we will be light in the dark world. God, that we will not be overcome with evil. God, but we overcome evil with good. God, that we will not lay down, that we won't give up. God, that we don't quit, that we will not be weary in well-doing. God, but we know that in due season we will reap if we faint not God and we will not faint when you are our strength oh God we will continue to pray without ceasing when you are our strength oh God God we will continue to fight the good fight of faith when you are our strength that we will continue to battle oh God and we will continue to fight for our families fight for our communities fight for our churches God fight for the congregations God that we will fight for the what is right in you and God we just thank you for your strength on this morning. God, we ask you to strengthen those, oh God, that are battling addictions. God, give them strength to stand, oh God, and strength to fight. God, strengthen those that are leaving abusive relationships. God, give them strength to stand and strength to fight. God, we ask you to touch those that are battling, oh God, with overeating and food addictions. God, give them uh, strength to stand and strength to fight. God, touch those that are changing their lives and um, starting new careers and new paths. Oh God, give them strength to fight on this evening, this morning, oh God, in the name of Jesus. <clears throat> and we magnify you today, God. We honor you and we give you praise. We thank you for your strength, oh God. Your strength to have discipline. Your strength, oh God, to move forward in the things of you. God, your strength to own up to the things that we need to take responsibility for 
want to allow you to wash us and make us clean according to your word. Give us strength, oh God. Give us your strength, oh God, to fight our pride, to, fr- to fight the pride of life, the lust of the eye, the lust of the flesh, God. Give us your strength, oh God, that we will not be weary, oh God, that we will run and not be weary. We will walk and we won't fade. God, that you will give us wings as an eagle. God, that we will have strength to soar above our problems and circumstances. God, give us strength on this morning. And God, we just glorify you on today. We magnify you on today. And we give you praise, oh God. And we praise and we thank you for what you've done. Praising and thanking you, oh God, for what you're doing. Praising and thanking you for everything that you're going to do. And Lord, we thank you for how you've been blessing, for how you've been keeping us, oh God. And we don't take it lightly. So strengthen us on this morning. Strengthen us throughout the day, God. In the name of Jesus, and we glorify you. We honor you and we give you praise in Jesus' name. Thank you all for being here. Thank you for watching today's prayer. Hopefully it fuels your prayer for today to pray for strength, not just for you, but for the family and your uh, communities and your schools and all your job that we have strength to fight and we just praise and we thank you if you are new watching this video on youtube or any other platform please know that you can find this video and all the others for the family consecration of 2021 the summer consecration for the british jones family on rashidamonique.com you can go there you can find the overview video and as you scroll you'll see each day's video and on the overview video you there is um, a video and a link for the calendar with your prayer focus and your scriptures and then there is a word document as well that tells you the certain outlines and you can go by those or you can uh, create your own fasting guidelines but all i ask is that you be diligent in prayer be diligent in the fast that you set and continue to go before the lord do not be detoured do not allow the enemy to hoodwink you or bait you in this season because i'm telling you he out here trying to bait people but god is faithful and he said with temptation he always gives us a way of escape and so we praise god that he doesn't allow us to be tempted above what we are able to bear but with that temptation he always supplies a way of escape so thank you all for being here thank you all for watching go ahead and share it invite and like my name is rashida brundage and i'll be glad to have you here on tomorrow you all be blessed and have a wonderful day